today we are going to see how to install and uh, view data from the PostgreSQL using uh, PG Admin 4. As we will go, we will see how to install it. We have to add the repository uh, public key. Public key for the official uh, PG Admin repository. You can find the required uh, instructions in the official PG Admin site. And we, we have to add the repository for the PG Admin uh, Now you can install the PG admin. I just added a repository and updated the repository list package list. Now we are going to install PG admin using sudo apt install PG admin. PG admin installation completed successfully. Now we can uh, use PG admin. We can open and we can use the PG admin. Open PG admin. We have to set the master password. So that our uh, we can uh, save our database passwords. So that we can save our database passwords securely and retrieve them later. Now we can add server, we can create new server connection by clicking on add new server and then enter, enter the connection name. database server host it is a local system so look uh, we are setting it as a local host now you can set the password for a postgres user using this you can log in <laughs> you can log into the database you can using postgres user you can log into the database I have to set the uh, password for Postgres user uh, by default uh, when we install the Postgres SQL it will not have a uh, password so I have to set it first uh, still we are getting the error uh, we have to we just set the uh, password in database also
password for uh, postgres user in the database by using alter uh, query just in, just setting the password as a root remove the postgres keyword and try it again Now the uh, password has been updated successfully. Now we can try try to log in from the PG admin. So it should work. So the connection has been established with the local uh, PG uh, PostgreSQL server. Now we can browse the databases, list of databases that we created. Uh, we can uh, sales. Uh, okay. The tiny DB uh, database that we have created uh, in the previous tutorial. And we can see the dashboard where we can see the stats, different stats. In the schema, we can find the tables. Query tool option will open the query execution uh, wizard where we can execute queries, SQL queries. We can uh, execute the queries like a select star from tiny links. We'll, uh, okay, we can run the query by clicking on that arrow. Now we can see the data. We can execute whatever the query we need. We can find the tables under uh, schemas. tables where we can find the graded uh, data tables available in the database for example this tiny links table is available under tiny db and we can browse the data we can browse the data using a view and edit data option We don't need to uh, execute the query directly. We can use this uh, option to view the list of rows. I select all rows or first only first hundred rows based on our need. Same way we can edit the data. I can change the data like this. We can change the data and we can uh, click on save. Save icon available in the top panel. We 
that's all the data has been saved that's all guys thank you subscribe and share with your friends